Welcome to I Found This Great Book. My name is Curtis, and today I want to bring you another great mystery author you should check out. And her name is Karen Grisby Bates. Now, Karen Grisby Bates is a senior correspondent for Code Switch. That's a podcast that reports on race. A veteran NPR reporter, Bates covered race for the network for several years before becoming a founding member of the Code Switch team. She is especially interested in stories about the hidden history of race in America and the intersection of race and culture. She oversees much of Code Switch's coverage of books by and about people of color, as well as issues of race in the publishing industry. But What we're interested in is the fact that she also is the author of two mystery novels. And those novels are Plain Brown Rapper and Chosen People. Her sleuth in both of these works is Alex Powell. And Alex Powell is a columnist for the Los Angeles Standard. And Alex Powell, in the process of her just trying to live her life and do her journalism work, gets pulled into mysteries and has to use her skills as a journalist and investigative skills to find out who committed the crime. So let's look at the first book, Plain Brown Rapper. I'm going to read the blurb for that. Who killed Everett Carson and why? The three most likely suspects are Ev's competitors, publishers of the country's other popular black magazines who all had plenty of good reason to make sure Ev never received his Journalism of the Year award. And with the help of Paul Butler, a fellow journalist and an old friend, Alex tries to untangle the circumstances that led to Ev Carson's death. Their investigative trail will carry them from the West Coast to the East, to DC, New York, and the social swirl of Martha's Vineyard as the summer season reaches its peak. In the middle of disc colleagues, dump girlfriends, disgruntled ex-employees, and the legion of enemies Ev managed to accumulate before he died, Alex Powell realizes that before everything is over, Everett Carson might not be the only person who ends up with a toe tag. Her other book, Chosen People. When Alex Powell stops into a Los Angeles bookstore on a rainy spring night, she's planning to write a column on the author who is reading and signing books there. But what she gets instead is a first-hand look at the murder of a controversial African-American writer, James Simpson Lee Hastings. His death sends seismic shockwaves through Los Angeles's black and white elite and reveals how some of the city's well-to-do are connected in ways they rather leave unmentioned. But trying to unravel those connections might mean that the next time Alex's name shows up in her newspaper, it won't be at the byline, but in her obituary. So. Karen Grisby Bates, two cool mysteries, and she gives you a peek into the journalism world, especially from the perspective of people who are creating journalism, targeting the African-American community. Really, really interesting. Those two books again, Plain Brown Rapper and Chosen People. So if you want to see those books, just go to ifoundthisgreatbook.com slash 114. Have the books there. You can actually click on a link and purchase a book. Really cool. Definitely want to check out her works. Well, until next week, 
and a new author from the Black Mystery Author Directory. Stay safe and have a great reading day.